Science tells us that the lowest energy state for a flexible rod is a straight rod. From a physics perspective, yarn is a flexible rod. This rod must be bent to form the loops through which other loops are intermeshed, creating a knitted fabric. In knitting, the loops take on the shape of an elongated loop. This loop would have high length shrinkage. After the loop is fully relaxed, it takes on a rounder shape, which is the second lowest energy state for a flexible rod. As subsequent processing applies stretch or consolidation, the loop will change shape, and shrinkage will increase or decrease. All cotton knit fabrics have a common fingerprint for shrinkage. Shown here is a typical length shrinkage curve. The process shrinkage for the length is shown on the vertical axis against the corresponding drop in moisture content as shown on the horizontal axis. This illustration shows the three distinct stages of shrinkage, elastic shrinkage, evaporation of water, and drying shrinkage. In the initial stage of tumble drying, the removal of surface or non-bound water begins and elastic shrinkage takes place. The flat part of the curve represents the area of evaporation of surface water or non-bound water. The shrinkage doesn't increase significantly until the moisture content of the fibers falls below critical moisture. This is because the fiber and yarn are still fully swollen and the weight of water trapped in the fabric and its lubricating effect acts as a force working against shrinkage. The third section of the curve represents de-swelling, which occurs after the surface water has evaporated. It has been shown that the greatest levels of relaxation occur at moisture levels below 20%. The level of moisture at which the fibers de-swell is known as critical moisture, since most of the shrinkage takes place below this level of moisture. In this phase of shrinkage, the shrinking once again occurs rapidly. Shrinkage of cotton goods is progressive in that it may take several cycles of wetting and drying to achieve fully relaxed dimensions, although one cycle may remove as much as 90% of the total shrinkage.